All right, Marco, it's all on you, brother. Action. Oh damn, we got you. Got to walk in your seat, bro. What? You got to start like just just stand on the carpet. I'm like, yo, give it up, and then you. I'm can already just... here. Come on. Come on. All right, we should. I'm gonna just welcome to the Marco show. We got a special guest today. I know you probably should, you want to get up and walk. No, nah, I'm already here. Uh, here, here. You from St. Louis? Dallas. Oh. You know where I'm from. You Dallas. know you cheating when you got glasses on. We can take them off. I right, bet. One on one. So let the world know who you are if they don't know who you are. I'm Jonathan Wright. But that's your left hand, or you said you're Jonathan Wright. It's the right way. So let them know who you are. Jonathan Wright. Are you an entertainer? I think I'm entertaining now. Mm -hmm. I think I'd have moved into the entertainment world. Mm -hmm. I'm Jonathan Wright, celebrity hairstylist. And that's it. Do you got anger issues? My guess is. You know, this is why I put all the clips, all the bullshit you done done. What and clips? Then, you got done. anger issues? Nah, you, I didn't see a lot of fights. A lot of. Well, I have to protect myself. You do? You never start shit, huh? Never. I'm not a starter. What? Never. So what's wrong with walking away? If I walk away, I might get hit in the head. No, it's, I'm saying that they don't be that close to you, though. Shit, you never know how close a motherfucker can get. Mm hmm if you walk away, you don't know what's behind you. But, you know, tour buses, when you see outside fights, inside, it's just like, where is it safe at? Church? You can fight on tour buses. Church. Outside. Take the guy. Last time you've been to church. Take. Two Sundays ago. Preacher name. Ricky G. Rush. Look at this guy. How about it? I'm gonna look him up. Look him up. Ricky G. Brush. Mm hmm. Ray Berlin. How long was the uh, service? service. Yeah. About 45 minutes. I'll say probably like 30 minutes. I slept 15 minutes of it. And what do you learn from it? To walk away. But you know what I'm saying? You gotta hold your ground before you walk away. Mm hmm. So. That's really what last um, church service was about. Mm -hmm. Walking away? Walking away, but still stand your ground. Mm -hmm. So when it comes to you and other people, do you feel like, what do you feel like you could take but can't take? They bullshit. Mm -hmm. Are you messy? I don't play that shit. Mm -hmm. That's just, mm -hmm. I'm a businessman. I stand on business. Mm -hmm. Tour buses. You see? Mm -hmm. So when it comes to the network, I see you got to the entertainment world. You're producing TV shows now. And how is that? How do you feel like that has opened a new door for you? It's doing good. I feel like I'm here. Mm -hmm. I'm on the Marco show. Yeah. But even before that, I knew you as a hairstylist, entertainment. Mm -hmm. Like you just showed your personality in the monkeys. No, I was selling yeah, my clients. Mm hmm. Yeah. So what made you what uh you know not know about the monkey? What mom made me move into the entertainment world? No, it made you get a monkey. Like the monkey are they monkeys? What they call? They're my sons. The son my like, child. They pass away. It, did you always want or is this like I one? always wanted a monkey. Mm -hmm. Always. I used to watch that movie. I had watched that movie Hangover one time. But I had always wanted monkeys before then. And then I used to have dogs, so I don't even like dogs no more. Mm -hmm. I used to have to clean up dog shit all the time. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Go in the backyard, clean up the dog stuff. So I'm like I hate a dog, but mm -hmm. I always wanted a monkey. Then when I got my monkey, I'm like, yeah, stop playing. Who? It's my son, Dior. No, I'm saying, who's playing? The world. Ah, okay. So, mug shots. What do you feel like your favorite mug shot is? Mug shots. My favorite mug shot is um, probably when I was 18 years old. Why do you got so many? Because I had a pass. People like to play. Mm -hmm. And they still playing, obviously. And they still playing. Mm -hmm. And it might be a couple more mug shots added to the list. Damn. So that's why I want to stop here. I want to figure out if we can do Wusa or anything that we can do. It's like therapy that we can take you away from the past that you are used to. I love And therapy. what do you feel like? I feel like if somebody was to ever swing at you, it's okay to get hit and say, you know what? 
I'm gonna change my weight. <laughs> it's okay to get hit. What's that? It's okay to get hit. No, it's okay, but I'm saying it depends. It's it's a difference when somebody's consistently trying to fight. It's, it's a difference when somebody hits you. Right. Why is it okay to get hit? No, if they add anger, but you got to realize who well, you why are. Why is it okay to get hit? Do you like people taking you out of character? Why is it okay to get hit? You're a businessman, right? Right, and I handle business. Yeah, that's not business beating people up. Yeah, it's not because I'm not in my business form no more. I'm outside of business. So what's wrong with you stepping into the boxing ring? But I'm just saying. Just I need to get. I need a big chick. Yeah. No, that, I'm just. No, no. I'm saying just leaving all that alone. Just becoming a professional boxer. I feel like I don't fight. I'm not a like. I'm not a fighter. I know how to fight, but I'm not. I'm not about to be the one who lose. Mm-hmm. I feel bad for him, mm-hmm. but. If the chick is there in the fight, in the boxing, I'm definitely there. Mm-hmm. Floyd, what's up? You want to fight him too? Nah, I ain't got time. I respect him. But yeah. So, Dallas, take us back to the childhood. Like, how do you feel like growing up in school? What do people know you for? People know me sell- from selling candy. Drugs? Candy. Like, cocaine? No, like, Snickers, <laughs> like, Oh, Starburst, oh, cold. Contacts. Like, I used to be up there selling candy. Mm-hmm. All the way up to middle school and everything. Mm-hmm. Three things that you do to make bring you peace. What are those three things? God. Being by myself. And traveling. Mm-hmm. Peace. Most money you just spent on the item? $1,800. I said eighteen hundred, eighteen thousand dollars. Oh, what? binding out of jail? Oh no, no, okay, yeah, that's the most money I spent on idol. Buying Buy money, Buy money. Yeah. Uh, do you want to send a message to the person that got you in jail? You want to look at that camera and tell them who got you in this? Try your luck, ho. You didn't try hard enough, cause I'm out, Who's, bitch. What was that? Huh? What was that? To the message to the motherfucker there, whoever wanted nah, me in jail. Did. He was like, make sure you get through the camera lens, but I'm make sure you get through it. Mm. So, when it come to you, I feel like you are an entertainer because people like. I'm just you Jonathan. Know, I'm Jonathan. I'm not an entertainer. You, if I was, I'd be getting entertainment chicks. I just live my everyday lifestyle. Mm-hmm. So, can you break down to the people what the show is about and why should people watch the show that you got out? What show? The show you got. Oh, the Bad Boy Show? Yeah. Yeah, pull up to the Bad Boy Show. Watch the entertainment. Bad Boys, to see who the baddest. Mm-hmm. Who's the baddest? <coughs> who? You know. <coughs> 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 <clears throat> Clear your throat. He in your face. Y'all see? <clears throat> Who's the baddest? No, I'm too much. All the cameras working, right? What's wrong with just calling yourself handsome? I'm very much handsome. You say you're the baddest. Because that's the show title. Bad Boys, and I have to let you know who the baddest. Who is? Uh, where they at? Behind you. So, I want to interview you as if you was the one to work for my company. Job interview questions, I want you to be completely honest. You got five seconds to answer the questions. I'll let you know if I hire you or not. Tell me about yourself. Five seconds, if you can get into it. I'm for it. Walk me through your resume. I like to entertain. 
How did you hear about this position? I heard it was free food at 12. Why do you want to work at this company? I heard y'all get the best pay. If you was to see an employee stealing from the cash register and you were working, A, let them slide, B, tell them stop, C, say, oh, I'm going to tell the manager, D, all the above. All the above. As long as they invested in my hair company. So if you see somebody selling from the register, you don't tell the manager, which is me. I'm interviewing right now. You need this job. Well, maybe I shouldn't tell you. Why? Because that ain't got nothing to do with me. I know, but if you see them stealing from my company, to let them know. I'm, I should. You think I should? Yeah. Okay. Tell me a challenge. Or something that you faced at work that you had to deal with and it really disturbing your peace. When people talk to me on my break. What motivates you? I'll be honest, I wouldn't hire you. <laughs> yeah. I wouldn't even, I don't even know how to interview. Clearly you do, you got that far. Well, shit. You can be honest. You know that you apply for jobs. Don't I don't you? apply for jobs. Yes, you do. But y'all came in the motherfucking thing, sir. Do you need a marketer? Do you need somebody to come in here and do something different to this? And that's that. If you don't want to hire me, you don't want to hire me. I'll take my business elsewhere. You can't do that. Yes, I can. No, you can't. Because it's a lot of people hiring. Right. And just where you don't want it, it's another motherfucker that need it. So what do you feel like we gonna we can do to get you to the next step to like do you need to get baptized? I was actually setting myself to be baptized. I got bap I get baptized like every two years. And what do you what the hell do it do to you? It got me this for. I'm saying not your success, but just like pure I'm pure. I'm yeah, from the soul, from everything. Yeah. Yeah, pure. You can be a good person. God, I'm no, spiritually. Mm -hmm. Spiritually leader. A spiritual leader. That's so you was in a choir? No, I was in the stands listening to what the preacher was saying. Mm -hmm. uh, brothers and sisters? I got two up? brothers. Mm -hmm. That was a good relationship? Yeah. Um, I just had to kick one of their ass. Because then they were sneaking some females in my house, and I told them, listen her. But I had to tell them. Except you got to hit them first? Had to. Because obviously I keep telling you what to do, and you're not doing it. Mm. No, I'm saying you got to hit the girl first before they hit her. Huh? Oh, no. Stop playing. Oh, you said you had to. <laughs> had to hit his ass, get it, kick his ass out and hit his ass. Mm. So you just... Fighting is not the answer. Hmm? Fighting is not the answer. Then listening to the person that's paying all the bills is should be the answer. So one thing that we did provide, if we, you know, I got to take you through canceling and we take you through, you know, cover the cost, are you willing to take on that? Who covering the cost? My production thing. Oh yeah, I love it. Man. It's free. I'm it's gonna be in there. Kentucky for a week. Kentucky? Yeah. They got some fried chicken. But it's no phones or nothing like that. As long as my mom got my phone, I'm good. Mm -hmm. You wanna take it for real? I'm dead serious. As long as it's nice, mm -hmm. I get some good sleep, good mm -hmm. peace. Oh, I'm nerd. They just gonna get you together because how they gonna get me together? That's what canceling is for. Okay. I'm already together. So, yeah. like, what is you saying? I'm saying mentally. Where do you feel like, because you said I need counseling. Where do you think I need counseling in? I mean, so far, you just said you didn't, you're, you're still fighting. I'm not fighting. You have, you just fought your I lay rules. It's lay laws. Okay, right. should I call the police? What's wrong with that? Would that make you a police hoe if you call the police? I don't know. What does it make me? Do you get mad when people call the police on you? No. Because I like to talk to the police, let them know what the fuck going on. Mm -hmm. And who was in the wrong? So you like to surrender? No, I don't surrender. Oh, well, you surrender. You in, you've been in jail before. Yeah, after I evaded the arrest. You definitely surrendered. <laughs> after I evaded the arrest. Have anybody ever put uh, trespassing on you or you got trespassing on no. somebody? Do I look like a trespasser? I can see you not giving a fuck about rules. Well, 
it don't get to the point of them not having to trespass me. Mm-hmm. Like, because if I did what I had to do, it's done. And you got a hair I'm bus. I'm going to get you before you get me. Huh? You got a hair bus, right? Yeah. Can you explain that to us? I see it a lot. So, yeah, I got the right way bus. It's my um tour bus. It's a tour bus. I be doing her traveling state to state. You know, that's what I do. So, how's that? Like, they just tour bus. You, I have never seen that before. Hmm. This is new. So, you go around. It's people. outside. Uh-huh. I go around and I be slammed. And I'll be in talking to my fans mm-hmm. and shit, getting money. Favorite person that you did the hair with? Eric Badu. How was that? It was everything. I love Eric Badu. Mm-hmm. It was great. Favorite food? Watermelon. Uh, I have a watermelon right there. I'm ready for you to cut it up, though. Uh, I would not do that. Then why is it right there? I'm not cutting the watermelon. Who cutting the watermelon? Oh, uh, uh, he do magic. You want to come show me? That's what's there. Yeah, magic. Ooh. You got to be shocked. You got to be shocked too. Mm-hmm. All right, do your routine. You want to see a watermelon disappear? Mm-hmm. Uh, three, two, one. I'm cut down. Go on. What? Yeah, Go on. Agmore shop. Agmore shop. Agmore shop. Oh my god. It's disappeared. I don't see it. Yeah. Huh? It's disappeared. That watermelon's on the ground. What? I, I didn't even see that. Oh. You seen that? Did it's you see it? It's not on the ground. Who It's not on the ground. All right. It's capping. Okay. <laughs> He's capping. All right. Well, Stop the cap. Thank you. Appreciate you. Okay. I'll come down because we need this watermelon. I need to eat it. You know, that was bullshit. I did say it disappeared. Hmm? It disappeared off the table. Mm-hmm. What? What's the first thing that you feel like you do right when you wake up? Waking up. Mm-hmm. After that. Brushing my teeth. Then what? Washing my face. Then after that? Listen to my music. Yeah. Gospel music. Then? Hitting the motherfucking streets. Getting lit. You got Tourette's? Hmm? You got Tourette's? What's Tourette's? Randomly doing things out of the blue. I think I do. Mm-hmm. But I never heard of it. Uh, Tourette's? Mm-hmm. It was like that where you kind of like... Because I be doing it. I really... I think I got Tourette's. Mm-hmm. It's Torex. 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 Yeah. And what it do? Uh, randomly doing things or blurting out things out of the blue. So randomly when you fighting people and as you swinging at them, you saying bitch, bitch, bitch over and over again. As you grabbing their hair, bitch, bitch, bitch. You're screaming and yelling out items that don't have nothing to do with what you got going on. <laughs> this sounds like me. Yeah. No, just let that sound like me. I mean, you do say a lot while you're swinging. Who? What's wrong with just being... I be laughing while I'm swinging. What's wrong with just being quiet and fighting? I do be being quiet. If you watch the videos... No, you actually talk to people and let them know what they're about to do to them. Do I? You let them know. You studied it. Y'all seen it. Shit, I thought I was quiet. No, you're not quiet. I had to let them hoes know that, bitch. Bitch. Do you feel it, bitch? That's probably why I was saying that. Right. Uh, somebody that you want to do the hair, if you can let us know on the show, like who hair you want to do it, let them know. Marco. You want to see funny Marco with a wig on? Uh, what about like, you know, no, a, you. I a dope ass you. female artist? You. A dope ass female artist? I got to be a female. I, see. You I, don't do, I did 6 9 Yeah. So. Again, female. Uh, I want to do Marco. Beyonce, I Beyonce, Beyonce. I could see if I could pick somebody for you and make it happen for my show. Who would I pick? Beyonce. No, I'm not. Definitely, I'm not. No, we're not. Well, I got what I can see that I feel like. Sexy red. Mm. Mm. Sexy red. Ooh. I'm doing. Let me pick. It's my shit. Hold on, I'm the guest. 
If I'm doing to her, yeah. yeah. This is my dog. Little mama. Perfect. That'll be a perfect person. Yeah. Can you send her a message? Little mama, come on now. I know you need that slay. You know you need that slay. Pull up. Can you do it with more energy? That's the energy that she getting. A little bit more. Little right. mama. Pull your ass up. What to do, y'all? It's your boy, Funny Marco. Little mama, Jonathan, want to send you a message. Pull up and come get slayed the right way. Don't do this at the end. Put your hand down. Look for it. What to do, little mama? It's your boy, Funny Marco. I'm here with my boy, Jonathan. He want to get you right. He about to tell you what he going to do to it. That's what you talk. Come get this 27 piece. Shit, no. It's not selling, bro. She not going to fuck with you. I'm not trying to sell it, baby. She not if it was Beyonce, you would have got the energy. No. We if it was Beyonce, man. bitch, I would have been standing up before me. I'm just saying I love you too, little mama, but... You know what I'm saying? Little mama not fucking with the energy. Okay. She, she ain't fucking with it. She don't need to fuck with it. So what to do, y'all? It's your boy, Marco, and I'm here with Jonathan. Little mama, he want to get you right. Go and tell her what you want to do. Pull up the right way, baby. That shit's sad. You said... You don't give a fuck. Oh. Hell not. Nah. Like, it's just like, come get slate. That's it. Like, like sell, she know what, no, sell, the pro you, sell the product. I am the product. Attitude. And you go to church, right? Mm hmm How do you feel like we should end the show? I just feel like... Come right chopping the watermelon. Nah, mm -hmm. I feel like it's something else out there that you got to let the people know. We got the show. We got the tour bus. We got the hair show. Coming up, the hair show that you're doing, that's dope. And the mm -hmm. tickets, or who bio again? My bio, my link, the link in my bio. We got a uh, hair show coming up. Uh, what's the dates? August 7th to the 27th. Mm -hmm. So when there's discounts off your, uh, discounts off his hair. With the funny Marco. No, it's just discount off his hair. All you need to do is just bring your own wig and John E will and slay sure it and get you right. Funny Marco and you're sticker. doing that. And you're doing your hair for free. With the Funny Marco sticker. So, yeah. I guess this is where we end it. How you want to end it? This show show. I don't know how to start it. Shit. I know I'm to be the one who starts shit. Mm -hmm. No, nah, like I started the show, not that type of start. I don't want no problem. I'm, I'm talking about start the show. Oh. I right. started the show. Yeah. So you didn't start the show. Let's end it. Welcome to the Marco Show. Y'all already know what the fuck going on. With Big Marco and this bitch. Oh, uh, we did not know what's going on. Yeah, we just did an interview, so they got to know what's going on. It's interview day. That was weak. Well, let me see what you got. What it do, y'all? It's your boy Marco. We're here with J Dog. J Dog is. Do I like a dog? No, like homie, like J Dog. Like, do I? That's weak. Come on. You gotta get better than that. What it do, y'all? It's your boy Marco. I'm here with Jonathan. What's up, y'all? Make sure y'all follow Jonathan and support his hair business because it's the best business ever and everything he got going on. I'm saying that with the most energy I can because it's the best. And I love it. And he didn't pay me to say this. I'm saying this out of my mouth. Better know it. Y'all better know it. Yeah. Yeah. The right way. The right way. Just waiting on him to get up, and that's when we done, y'all. I'm waiting on you to walk off. Oh, shit. Because I'm telling you, if I when I get up, I'm really going to keep walking for real. Don't try me, because I'm going to get up and walk off. I'll, be, I'll wait on you. Is the show done or not? 
Let me hear the production people in the back. Clap two times if this is done. They don't even work for real. I just got them off Netflix. Okay, I ain't heard them clap. You clapping? You got to clap. Oh, fuck. You going to clap? Everybody just be, see? Everybody probably too big. That's not production. Those production assistances. <laughs> Team, y'all ready? Let me hear y'all clap. Because when y'all clap, it's done. You gonna shout them out? Why you say team? You wanna hide your team? You can't say their names? They know who come behind me. All right, y'all. Uh, another intro. There's Marco. And I'm with your boy. You really just threw a peace sign? Yeah. Oh, my God. Don't do that again. Don't. All right, we, but we about to end it, y'all. <laughs>